And now, your East Texas Storm Team forecast. Well, Andrew, thankfully, we are not talking about tornadoes and severe weather this week. We're getting a nice reprieve from all the rain and getting to enjoy the sunshine. Yeah, today is a really nice day to get outside. We've got mostly sunny skies out there with some passing clouds, as you can see behind me in Longview. We've got some clouds out there, but also plenty of blue skies as well. This is our sky view camera brought to you by the Monsoor Law Firm. Temperature now up to 68 degrees with a dew point of 55, so it is a comfortable late morning for us. Temperatures around the region in the upper 60s for the most part, but we are already into the 70s in Henderson, Palestine and Lufkin, very close to there elsewhere, so it is a mild day for us. High temperatures on track to make it into the middle 70s, perhaps a few upper 70s as well as we head into this afternoon as we see a pretty warm day overall, a little bit warmer than yesterday. Winds out of the east at around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Now the normal high temperature is 76 degrees. We'll be around there today and tomorrow, but then on a Friday and Saturday we will see those highs return to the lower 80s out there, so we'll get even warmer as we close out this work week and that a cold front moves in Saturday which knocks down the temperatures briefly heading into the start of next week. Before that cold front, though, we've got a low pressure system off two hours south, which will help fire off some showers and maybe a thunderstorm on Wednesday, primarily south of Interstate 20. So here's what Futurecast has going into the day on Wednesday. We start off dry, but then showers and storms start to move on in from their south into the Toledo Bend area at first and then gradually lifting further to the north. As you can see, it's widely scattered activity, so we're not expecting any major rainfall, uh, but a few thunderstorms cannot be ruled out. So weather though not expected for us for our Wednesday. We'll start to see the rain showers and thunder showers die down as we head into the evening hours. Now attention turns to Friday with our next cold front moving on in or getting closer to our area will bring a risk of strong to severe thunderstorms, especially in our northwesternmost areas from Van Zant Rains and Hopkins County to the north to the Red River uh, area there in Texoma. So we'll definitely be watching Friday into Saturday pretty closely here, but for our day today we'll see mostly sunny skies with a few more clouds down into deep east Texas developing as we head into the afternoon. High temperatures today in the middle 70s with that east wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And then for tonight, we'll see mostly clear skies with more clouds in deep east Texas. Once more, temperatures dropping down to the lower 50s with an east wind between calm and 5 miles per hour. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. Now we are going to see Dry conditions for our northern areas for the next several days here. Again, we had that storm threat late Friday into the day on Saturday. Saturday, a chance for some isolated showers, maybe a thunderstorm early on, and then we'll dry things out for Sunday and Monday with those highs in the 70s. Again, with that uh, small chance of severe weather late Friday into Saturday, it's important to have multiple ways of receiving weather alerts. One such way, the East Texas Storm Team app, which you can get by scanning that QR code at the top right of your screen, get alerts directly to your phone as soon as a warning is issued issued for your area for deep east Texas. That QR code pops back up there and we will see that chance of isolated showers for our day on Wednesday. Maybe a thunderstorm, but severe weather not expected for Wednesday and then we'll be dry through Friday. More showers and storms arrive Saturday again, mainly during the first half of the day and then we will dry things out as we head into Sunday and Monday for your latest weather forecast. You can head on over to our website 